CBS and almost two. A two dotter. Wow. Uh, this has been an no. amazing at bat. No, he moved out of the way of it. Feely's thrown it all over the place. Yeah. All right. A lot of count. arm angles. Feels like a lot of legs, a lot of movement, a lot of distraction for the batter. But one four and all black underneath his eyes. How are you supposed to stay focused with that staring at you? Ball hit. Ah! And Mickey Cass, a diving attempt, but instead it'll go as a knock. And there's a little bit of a shit stir going on. Oh, there it is again, the twinkle toes and the fall. Oh, oh, classic, oh, no. classic twinkle toes. Wow. Jake talking trash about that. The, look at that. He takes that. some balls when you're down four it runs sure to be does. talking trash. That's why we love him. That's why he hits 7,000 at every hit bat. I bet the replay of that looks hysterical. The replay of that that's probably looks cool. fucking unbelievable. Oh, that's on me. You're that guy. I believe in you. Let's do it. You picked me up all game. Tunnel vision, the top right half of the plate. Tunnel vision, tunnel vision. Zoom in on it. No, oh, that's it! Oh, walk off! Look at me, oh my goodness. MVP Jack Doyle, Jack Doyle. Uh, game's Not over. Only Trevor Plouffe, hey, nastiness. Just easy. It's just easy, isn't it? Yep. So he's going to work the first inning, and because of the brand new pitching rules, he is going to have to relinquish to his teammate Vinny Rotino in inning number two. So it has to be a shutdown inning for the man who finished second in the MVP voting for Jake Storial this season again. Hey, time, time, can I get time? Yeah. Nikki time. calling a quick time. Uh, some the gimmick show. going on. Oh, there's still points. What's the scouting what report? What is going on? Scouting report. Oh. oh, what is this? What is that? What, what is that? Pax, find that out what Pax, that is. What is that, um, can I ask what? It, it's, it's a picture of Trevor. It's a picture of Trevor. Can I ask you why? Oh, I'll show you in a second. Okay. okay. All right. Let's just, let's just strap in, guys. He's not going to take a leap. Oh, oh my God. now we see it. Oh. Now we see it. Okay, a little tea bag. I like that. Oh, my gosh. I I'm going to be ill. Oh! oh. 77, 77 <laughs> of the ass cheek. I love it. He didn't go high. He got him in the right respectful area. I, I saw it coming. Actually, I, I appreciate that he hit me in the ass and not in the face. I That's what I'm saying. Nice job, Nikki Cass. Good response. Fuck that you. Hey. Warning? Hey. Seriously, did our hey. umpires just give warnings? Hey. Hey. Fuck your warning. Fuck your warning. This is disrespectful in the best way possible. Oh! oh. Maybe he has. Don't say anything, Vinny. Hey, don't I'll say anything. One. I mean, I don't know what the next pitch is going to do. Should I bust out a slider right here? Stay right here. You can. I think that's one, two. I like that waist pitch. Go. <laughs> this you, me with me. you throw a slider at the object. Check swing. What's the bet? Drop it. One strike away from advancing. Oh. Whoa. Insult to injury. Not only are you going to check man. swing, you're going to check your pants. Might I just say, Dan just looked over at his teammate and said, and I quote, I wish that would have hit me in the head. Wow, confident. Wow. Maybe he feels bad about hitting Trev in the head. That's not it. Oh, good take. Good take, good good take by Dan. Rourke. You got two pitches right here to get us in the championship game. Me on the fucking bump for two innings against Love Yous. Redemption fucking tour, 10 Gs. Make the fucking pitch. Let's go. Let's go, Rourke. I, like, I think Chef's giving him a pump up. Let's I think that's a pump up. The 3 2. Oh! He didn't check swing. Forgotten Rotten is headed back to the championship game where it will face Nikki Cash and Team Lavias. Dan Rock is absolutely beside himself. Look at that. Wow. He doesn't want to leave and look up from his microphone. He pack. didn't even shake hands. He didn't look up. Wow. Unbelievable. Base is loaded. Right here. Just go right up. We're good. We're good. It'll affect us later on. We're not. You got this. They will stick with Rotino. Base is loaded. We love it. We love it. Wow. The drama. Oh, oh, that is oh a walk-off double. That is oh a game-winning double. 
Oh, what a moment! That is a walk-off win! Unbelievable! That is a game winner by Nikki Cass! Oh, no, they're ringing their bell. That is a kick in the bell ball. Oh, great pitch. Fell out of the strike zone. Even things up at two and two. And that may have been his nastiest one yet. Set him up right now for the fastball. Ball, oh, look like at Ploof. A one hopper. <laughs> wow, Bossy wondered if he juggled it, but Ploof was like, nah. Look at this, it was almost as though he had spider tack on that thing. You know, what's funny is uh, Ploof was actually juggling pregame, but he's not juggling there. And that was a, what a great play, Trevor Ploof, to be able to save him. Saved a run, kept it scoreless, and now the one seed forgotten rotten with a chance to walk it off here in X. The animal he relates to most, an otter. Do you guys know why? Because, because they're they slept suck at, on. Oh, because they suck at blitz Because ball. they're slept on, they can do some damage, they're sneaky handsome, and they don't have many fans, but the ones that they have are diehards. Oh, that's sweet. I, I should take that back. I didn't, I didn't like that. Yeah, you do you feel bad about your answer now? No, because people would say the same thing about me if I were up there swinging. Oh, okay. So, and listen, <laughs> hey, you put yourself out there for ten grand. people are going to take shots at you. All right, so now we've got some uh, new rules in extra innings. Runners are at the corners with one out, so the defending team has just got to record one out. Jolly Olive, 0 for 2 on the day, a pair of strikeouts. Bossy has been perfect so far. Four batters faced, four Ks. He has been phenomenal. There's a ball put in play, but oh. snagged by McDonald. What a play. That was amazing. That was an awesome play. All on the line for the back daddy. Look at this. Olive thought he had one. Slams his hat down in disgust. Woo! Takes a deep breath as that saves a run and ends the frame in the top of the third. Oh, and he hit him, and now the bases are loaded. So Blevins, who has been the workhorse of Shea Station, has got to figure out how to get out of this jam. But if there's anybody in this tournament that can do it, it's a 13-year big league vet. I mean, this is great here. Um, so... So oh, hits it up the middle. Wow. Yeah, look at so. The halfway jaunt to first. He loses his lid. He does a chest bump, not realizing that's not a walk off. It's not a walk off, so I don't know. Maybe he thought about it. Maybe he thought it was, but. Um. He said, I'm 0 for 20. I needed that. <laughs> so We Got Ice gets on the board here in the top of the frame, looking to tack on more with the bases loaded and nobody out. And once again, team baggage going with the Ken Griffey Jr. hat backward. Story Ali has been phenomenal in this tournament. Elite best six hits. Yeah, he's batting 750, so he's doing pretty good. And here we go, a berth in the championship game is underway. And they throw, oh, but too fast to strike. Oh, and the crowd has started to get inside the head of T. Plouffe. 70 miles per hour, one mile an hour too fast, according to the rules. Yeah, I mean, you know, the number one team that Team Baggage was worried about was actually Forgotten Rotten. Boom, fouled away. And it was specifically because of Trev. Uh, John Boy himself says, man, Trev, I just cannot, you know, I cannot hit him. So let's see how that works out today, but. It's big swing and a miss. Nice pitch, a riser. 
up and away. He's got to compose himself here. Trevor Plouffe, the best two-way player coming out of high school in the 2004 draft out of Crespi. Wow. Well-known private school in Los Angeles. And look at this. He's even telling Jake what's coming. And that was a, a damning wow. move by Plouffe. As Story Ali knocks it off the wall and then off the back wall. And a leadoff knock. He uh, said, here's what's coming. And he said, great, I'll take it. And that was funny. Right after that, Jake looks at him, does the same move back to him, like, here's your fastball. Yeah, it's a double. Get, a, get out of here, please. Thanks. Teammates in the podcast world, adversaries on the Blitzball Diamond. That's $10,000. Team, team baggage has a leadoff double to get things going here in the winner's bracket. That is the first hit Trev has given up in this entire tournament. What do you call this cut on Dan's jersey here? Is that a is that a slim fit arm, arm cut? Hey, somebody has been uh, putting on his, his man muscles in the gym lately. A little bit of creatine in there, too. Come on, Danny boy. We don't test at the, uh, at oh. the media company. Oh, that's yeah. I don't think all the trusts have worked in the world. Strike. Fix. That's yeah. weird. He had a tough go in the first tournament. He played in boots and jeans. Good stance. And 0 for 6 with 6 Ks. That's okay. Oh, yeah. hey, so, oh. He's got way too much legs. Yeah, there's a lot going on. There's a lot of movement. Maybe with as much uh, weight as he's been lifting lately, he should put a couple of 25-pound plates yeah, on the other side of the bat. Right? Love that. So Colin Stone is, uh, has given up the dream of uh, chasing, becoming a baseball player. He's currently trying to help others achieve that dream. He's now a, an independent pitching coach for hire. Good so for if him. you're in the Jonesboro, Arkansas area, give this guy a call. Oh! My God! Work with his first knock! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Fans pouring out of the stands to give 99 is just due. I mean, if there's ever a time where you hit the barrel and he does not, I mean, that's not that's the pitcher hitting the hit the bat. No, I'm saying swinging buns play. That was unbelievable. Bro, I swear nothing's ever felt that good. Today is the Dan Rourke Revenge Tour, and I'm back. He did in fact say that. It is It is the revenge tour. Revenge tour of Dan Rourke. And I got to say, nothing has ever, and I mean this, I don't think anything ever compares to how I felt hitting that ball right there. That felt nice. Oh. Hi. Ooh, very tempting, top part of the zone there. Three, two. Cannot walk him. Jake has to throw a strike right here. Don't want to go to a full count. Vinny can hardly stand the suspense down here. He's been hiding in his clothes and his hat, now ducking behind the bench here. <laughs> Just missed and we have a full count. <laughs> so here we go. You can cut the tension with a knife right now. It's unbelievable. Once again, consulting John Boy on the mound. Else? Trev, what are you looking for right now? Uh, anything over the plate. I mean, he knows this is my zone. This is my box right here. You got to come in. This is it. Ooh, probably time again. Maybe a little too much thinking for Story Ali. Sure. Dan getting the crowd right now? Getting in his head. Yeah. That was a good one. That's oh. Big swing and a miss, and Story Ali has done it! Team Baggage knocks off the number one seed and gets the celebratory pastry on top. Unbelievable pitch. He threw him an off-speed pitch at the end. Got him to swing over it inside corner. He's being crowned. Ooh, unbelievable. And they're hugging in the middle of uh, the diamond. Remember, you can be eligible to win $250 with a great comment on our YouTube channel. Oh, you have to be a subscriber to the Warehouse oh, Games in order to qualify. Might be locked in here. I say it all the time. If you're going to get to an ace, you've got to get him early. If you ah. let him off the hook, it's over. Except that isn't Jimmy their ace? I don't know. 
There's the ball hit and oh! oh! I said, I said, <laughs> I'm sorry, Jake. I called you unathletic. I have to apologize. That was absolutely beautiful. For the booth. Younger Jay catches it twice. The agility of a mongoose. That was like Bo Jackson back in the day. Did you see him run up the wall? I didn't, but I just, I imagined it. I want to see Come a split next. screen of the Bo Jackson One play next. where he catches Come it and next. runs up the wall. Let's go, Thank ladies. you, editor extraordinaire. He's in the zone now. Oh shit, we, we have the lead. Yeah. Like it. He loves the outside with that same pitch. It's always strong. I'm waiting for that low fastball. Look great. What? You look great. Yeah, it didn't come back a little bit, but. Oh! Oh my God, Jelly! Are you a second, Jelly? It's Jelly Ali! It's Jelly Ali! Oh my God, what a ball! I can't believe it! Jelly Ali with devastation! This is the greatest day of his life! Unbelievable! Somebody raised the big apple out of the Ooh, hat! Jolly, Jolly, how are you feeling after that? I don't know. <laughs> really good. Really happy. Sorry, I have no words. I want to go say hi. That's awesome, man. That's fucking awesome, man. That's awesome. That's awesome. Jolly Olive! Taking the bosses deep and knocking team baggage out of its quest to hoist the cup. Instead, Shea Station is moving on. Look at Jimmy's reaction. You can see his soul leave his body. Oh my God. Oh, there it is. You can see it. He said, I need to establish the velo against Jolly. Jolly knew it. It was power versus power, and that is the swing we're looking for. Did he you knew see it. the bat flip? Jolly Olive. Congratulations. Certainly the greatest athletic moment of his life. Maybe the greatest moment of his life, Trevor Plouffe. So now I'm Forgotten Rock is one out away from winning the first ever Blitz Ball Battle presented by DraftKings and pocketing $10,000. That's a lot of Rutinos. I'm getting sweaty here, Chris. Woo! I think Jimmy was thinking about tying this game up with that swing. You know, he kind of got a little bit too big there with that swing, saw it, and just thought he could put it in play. And I think you're going to see a slider here. Jimmy hasn't been yeah. able to pull the trigger on it. Let's see. There it is. That's oh, it. great call, Blevins. There it is. I think he's going to get another one. And he's going to try to get him to chase away like he yes, did in that first at-bat. Absolutely. You got to double up. Yep. You could tell that's a tendency for John Boy to swing. He's going to have to remain very disciplined on this. Trev could get him to swing over it and then clinch this for Forgotten Ryan. Here we go. The 0-2. Oh. He got that's him. It. Got him looking. It. Forgotten Rotten. The one seed wow. has won it all. And look at the celebration in our <laughs> one of a kind warehouse in Jersey City, New Jersey. who have stared down some of the greatest pitchers in Major League history, but look at the smiles on their faces. Triumphant at the blitz ball level. Winners of $10,000 and the celebratory champagne splurge. Oh, oh he gets him looking. And Forgotten Rotten is one out away from okay, lifting hey. its second hey. title. One more, we get another banner. I like that. Oh, oh Cass! Foul ball. ball. Okay. But he's, see that? Love that? You making Love contact it. on that pitch? 
I mean, I, I did last year. Yeah, I did it you. this year. This is a reigning MVP, yeah, dude. Right. He was 18 year. for 19 or something. I did last year. Yeah, that's... Okay. Sorry, sorry, baggage fans. Oh, oh it's 0-2. Oh the champagne is on ice. Yeah. Ploof and Rotino are getting their ring-sized. <laughs> Actually, they said <laughs> our <laughs> fingers haven't grown in months. Just give us the same size rings, bitches. <laughs> It's oh! over! It is over! <laughs> the law firm of Ploof and Rotino successfully defend their crown! Uh, that must feel so good. Yeah, we're just the greatest of all time and we proved it again here today. You're welcome. You've got, you, you all have witnessed greatness.